she was in here probably for about less than two minutes. She took our cash box uh, before we did our deposit, of course. And she also took a student's wallet. An Edmonton yoga studio owner shares that on Tuesday, their cash box full of over $600 was stolen. And the suspect, who's not a regular student, was recorded on a security camera. We are not showing the woman's face, as police have not charged her or anyone yet in the crime. It's hard to deal with that, especially when a yoga studio hopefully has this place of trust and safety when you enter it, and that's how we want it to be. Before this incident, Shala's owner heard of thefts that happened at another yoga studio around early July in Edmonton and had a suspicion it was the same thief. One of the students running late to class did go into the change room and noticed a girl that was going through bags and stuff but didn't think anything of it, thought it was just a girl going through her bag. Then after class, four people noticed that their phones were gone, their keys were gone or that their wallets were gone. The two yoga studio owners are in a Facebook group with other owners and after some independent sleuthing they found Facebook profiles and photos of the woman whom they believe is responsible for the crimes. We had her her visuals, her face in our mind. So when I saw the video that uh, our neighbors had taken, the security footage, I was like that's her. That's totally her. The two owners named other yoga studios that they say the woman has also stolen from, but City News did not get confirmation from those studios in time for our broadcast deadline. Edmonton police have been notified, but the owner of Om Hot Yoga says he doesn't feel like investigators are doing much to prevent the crimes from reoccurring. We have been able to identify this person, so I'm not understanding how this is continually going on where they're able to, every week, go into a different studio and continue to steal, continue to steal, continue to steal. We reached out to EPS for a comment on these cases, but the investigator could not give us a reply before our broadcast deadline. In the meantime, Shala's owner says they'll be stepping up their security. So we're working on getting some more secure doors. Uh, we do have cameras. And for us, we don't want to have our door locked all the time. We want people to be able to come in and we, because we trust our students. In Edmonton, Sarah Chu, City News.